Hello, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Yeah, let me see. Let's see how you are doing with the homework four. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Final. Teacher, I have a question. Mm -hmm. What is your question? Tell me, what is your question? For unit four, for, for unit four, when is the last day for we can finish the homework in the platform? Tuesday. Next Tuesday. Unit four and the final exam. Everything must be done by Tuesday. Okay, thanks. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. I'm checking. Only six have completed the part, the unit four. Um, only six. That's okay. Most of you only have two homeworks, one. That's okay. But I think you better move in advance if possible. Adelante, si puede. Here, final exam, only five. Posting. Yeah, aprovechen el, el weekend. Porque de martes en la noche se va todo. Como esté. Vamos.
<clears throat> okay, people, let's get started. It's time. Friday. Thank God it's Friday. Now, oh, ustedes son muy jóvenes para saber de esa película. Thank God it's Friday. Cuando puedan, busquen la regla. Eh, gracias a Dios es viernes. Ok, ¿dónde voy? ¿Dónde voy? Acá. Alison Andrea Serrano. Present teacher. Ok. Welcome. Carla Yasmin Riera. Present. Bless you. Carlos Jonathan García. Daniel Ernesto Membreño. Present. Okay. Eh, Edwin Mauricio Pineda. Present. Okay, welcome. Eric Mauricio Cruz. Present. Okay. Gilberto Benito Santa Maria. Present teacher. Okay. Jennifer Guadalupe Elías. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Jose Andrés Martínez. José Andrés. Julio César Fabián. Present teacher. Okay. Noé Gustavo Núñez. Present teacher. Eh, Omar Alexander Chávez. Raúl Edgardo Sarceño. ¡Ya voy! Ok. Rosalina Esmeralda Sánchez. Present teacher. Ok. Salvador Alberto Soriano. Salvador. Present. Virginia del Carmen Vázquez. Presente. Present teacher. Ok. Vladimir Alejandro García. William Boris Roque. William Rodrigo Ángel. Ok. Very good. Ok. Last class we studied some, uh, well, the use of wool like would like to to practice or to make an offer to offer something or to request something or to say what you want so we use would like would like to para ofrecer algo to offer para pedir algo to request something o para decir lo que quieres. To say what you want. Okay. And uh, we were talking about equipment. Um, particularly we, we were talking with problems with printers. Okay. Problems with printers. Uh, we have an article here. This article is about printer qualities. Uh, 
Yeah. Printer qualities. Let's read about printer qualities and answer the questions. Okay, who's this? Who's this? The wheel. Let me read this article. I'm going to read it. So you can practice later the pronunciation, okay? Just listen, and I'm going to record the audio here in WhatsApp. Later, I will ask you to, to read, maybe to practice the pronunciation. Okay. You need to print pages, other pages where color is part of the information. Printers can also be set to print only in black and white. Printers are more expensive to operate since they use two ink cartridges that need to be replaced after a certain number of pages. Print pages will find a black and white cheaper print. Two resolution. Printer resolution, the sharpness of text and images on paper, is usually measured in dots per inch, DPI. Most inexpensive printers provide sufficient resolution for most purposes, at 600 dots per inch. Speed. If you do much printing, the speed of the printer becomes important. In expensive printers, print only about three to six sheets per minute. Color printing is slower. More expensive printers are much faster. Memory. Most printers come with a small amount of memory. For example, one megabyte that can be expanded by the user. Having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printing out pages with large images or tables with lines around them, which the printer treats as a large image. Questions. One, why is color important for some users? Two, what does DPI stand for? Three, why are color printers more expensive? Four, what is something important for someone who prints a lot? And five, what is the amount of memory that most printers come with? Okay, that is the whole article about printer quality. I will read it again. Please pay attention to the intonation and the pronunciation, okay? Printer qualities. Color. Color is important for users who need to print pages for presentations or maps and other pages where color is part of the information. Color printers can also be said to print only in black and white. Color printers are more expensive to operate since they use two ink cartridges, one color and one black ink, that need to be replaced after a certain number of pages. Users who don't have a specific need for color and who print a lot of pages will find a black and white print cheap printer cheaper to operate. Resolution. Printer resolution, the sharpness of text and images on paper, is usually measured in dots per inch, DPI. Most inexpensive printers provide sufficient resolution for most purposes at 600 DPI. Speed. If you do much printing, 
the speed of the printer becomes important. In expensive printers, print only about three to six sheets per minute. Color printing is slower. More expensive printers are much faster. Memory. Most printers come with a small amount of memory. For example, one megabyte that can be expanded by the user. Having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printing out pages with large images or tables with lines around them, which the printer treats as a large image. Why is color important for some users? What does DPI stand for? Why are color printers more expensive? What is something important for someone who prints a lot? What is the amount of memory that most printers come with? Five questions to respond from the article. Any question with the article, with the reading? No, teacher. Okay. So I will send it to working groups. You, want, you can read the article one more time if you want. You can take turns to practice reading. And after that, you are going to respond the five questions, okay? Work together, working group, to respond the five questions with information from the article. All right, so let's see. let's see. Okay, join your groups, please, and respond to questions with information from the article. See you in a moment.
Rosalín. Hello, Gilberto, ¿qué pasó? Me lo sacó el Inter. Sí, perdí la conexión. Ahorita lo envío de regreso. Ahí está la invitación. Why are, the, why are the color printer more expensive? I.e. the color printers more expensive are more faster. Are the more, or there are the more faster? No. Uh -huh. There is most faster. Son las más este, rápidas. Why? Because there are more faster. No, there is more faster. ¿Verdad? Ah, pues sí, estaría bien entonces esa de ACDP. En la teoría, ¿por qué este, las impresoras a color son más caras? Entonces sería, este, because there are more faster. O sea, porque son más rápidos. ¿Estamos de acuerdo? Sí, sí, sí. Ah. Eh, eh, la otra, la cuatro sería What is something important for someone who prints a note? ¿Qué es lo más importante para alguien que imprime mucho? Imprime mucho. ¿Cuál es la cantidad de memoria que viene la mayoría de los impresores? If you do more sprinting, printing, printing the, la velocidad de la impresora es más importante. La, the printing becomes import. La, of the print, which is your print. Eh, ¿qué Memory. ¿Qué es lo más importante para una persona que, que, que imprime mucho? La velocidad. Ajá, uh -huh, speed. The speed. ¿Verdad? ¿Verdad? No, 
The speed. La sí, velocidad. The speed of the print. La velocidad de la impresora. The speed of the printer or printer. The speed on the print. La velocidad de la printer. De la printer. Are much faster. Is lower. No. He puesto is more expensive because printers are much faster. Lo que le parece en, en renglón 2, en mi speed. Ah, more expensive printers are, are much faster. Ajá. Uh -huh. Y la cuarta, what is some, something important for some who friends love? Mm. Quiero ver, dice. Ahí sí iría la parte donde usted dijo de, de, de 3 a 6. Donde dice. Quiero ver, if you do much printing, despero of the printer because of the six sheets per minute. Se viene con la mayoría de las impresoras. Sí. What is the amount? Eh, lo que dice aquí. Pero no dice cantidad ahí. No, solo da el ejemplo de... Solo un, dice... Un megabyte. Ajá, un, ajá un megabyte. pero dice que esa es de las como... Eh, como una pequeña cantidad. Ajá. Al menos que sea ese. Mods, printer, con... Why a small amount of memory? For example, one megabyte. Hasta el punto. En la cuatro, what is something important for someone who prints a lot? Is, is, según el texto, eh, this speed if you do much printing the speed of the printer becomes important Entonces, yo pienso que es la, la velocidad donde donde está la de speed según lo que leo yo print only about much speed <laughs>
Okay, welcome back. Muy bien. Um, so I would like you to uh, let me see. Let me see. Okay. Uh, Did you finish the five questions? I hope you did. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, I'm going to, well, I would like you to choose a, like a secretary for per group. Okay, let's call it a secretary per group, a representative per group, okay? Uh, let's see, group number one, Jennifer, Andres, uh, and Julio. Who is the, who is the representative or the secretary? Es decir, lo que, lo que yo quiero es que no todos escriban en el chat, sino solo uno por grupo. That's why I want a representative per group, okay? Okay. So in group number one, who is the representative? Quien quieren nombrar? Supongo que todos tienen la respuesta. Yes. O lo escojo yo. Piedra, papel, tijera. Oh, Julio. You want to be the, the secretary? Yes. Okay. Yeah, bye. Take it easy. Take it easy. Group number two, we have Daniel, Noe, and Virginia. Daniel, it's okay for you? Yes. Okay. Group number three, I have Gilberto and Rosaline. Rosaline, it's okay for you? Okay, teacher. Group number four, Alison, Carla, and Salvador. Salvador, please. It's okay? Yes, no problem. Okay. And group number five, Edwin. Ya me desapareció el otro aquí, no me aparece. ¿Quién era el otro, Edwin? Yo soy teacher. ¿Quién dijo yo soy? No lo veo. Omar. Ah, Omar. Okay. Omar, it's okay for you? Okay. Okay, so, good. So, question number one. Why is color important? Let, let me do something. Give me a second. I'm going to write the question and I want you to write the answer. Okay, I see. Question number one. Why is color important for some users? Uh, uh, okay, debo tener cinco respuestas. I have two. Only two. Oh, okay. User need to print pages and send the maps or the page. Okay. Uh, okay. One, two, three, four. Me falta uno. Falta 
Ana, Daniel ya está, Omar, Salvador, Rosalín. Ah, no, ya están todos. One, two, three, four, five. Ok. Ok. Julio says because when we need to print pages. Ah, le falta más, le falta más. It's important to print pages for presentations or maps. Ok, por ahí va, por ahí va. Because some users need to print pages for presentations or maps and other pages where color is part of the information. Okay. Good. Because need to print pages for presentations or maps and other pages. Uh, the color is important for some users because need to print pages for presentation. Okay, very good, very good. Color is important, okay, for, um, for documents where color is important, right? So, <clears throat> color, here is the answer, yeah. Color is important, no. Color is important for users who need to print pages for presentations or maps and other pages where color is part of the information. Okay, very good. Let me see. Question. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, this is simple. Let me write the question. Two. What does DPI stand for? Mm -hmm. The meaning is dots per inch does mean that's per inch, it does mean that's per inch. It's meaning that per inch. One more. One, two, three, four. Me falta una. Okay. I'll best just correct the form. Yeah. The meaning is that per inch. In points and inches in the sharpness of the text called DPI. Yeah, but what is DPI? The question is, what is the meaning of DPI? What does DPI stand for? In other words, is what is the meaning of DPI? ¿Qué significa DPI? Okay. Uh, podríamos decir DPI stands for that per inch. Okay. Esto sería una manera de decirlo. DPI stands for dots per inch. Usando las mismas palabras de la pregunta. What does DPI stand for? Yeah. DPI stands for dots per inch. O podemos decir it means significa dots per inch. Okay. Ahí el TAS, ya en la respuesta no, no se utiliza. Recuerden que en affirmative sentences, we don't use auxiliary verbs. Okay. 
in auxiliary sentences, no, uh, perdón, in affirmative sentences, no usamos auxiliares. Auxiliaries like do, that, or did are only for questions or negative sentence. Okay. In affirmative sentences, we in present we use the verb in present. In past, we use the verb in past. Okay. Good. Question number three. Give me a second. I'm going to put the question. Oops. Why are color printers more expensive? Why? Reason. Okay. Two ink cartridges. Ya está un poco atrasado este artículo. No, todavía hay cartridges, right? What is, the, <laughs> what is the meaning of cartridges? Cartuchos. Cartuchos. Así todavía hay. Hay de sí, cartuchos. ¿no? Sí, Car y la modelo 2775 HP todavía usa cartuchos. Oh, caros son en Ocolado. <laughs> They are really, really expensive. Lo que vale la impresora, van en... Yeah. Uh, it's more slow to print and to operate since then used to ink cartridges. Uh, well, the reason is that they use to cartridges. Yeah, they need two ink cartridges, one for color and one for black and white. Okay. Yes, you're right. Two cartridges. Or nowadays they need how many how many four colors, right? Black, uh, red, yellow, and cyan. Or no. Yes. Magenta. Magenta, le dicen, pero no. But magenta is like, like red. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Which one is cyan? Cyan is blue, right? Like blue. Like blue. Uh -huh. And yellow. Magenta, yellow. cyan, and yellow. And black. Okay. Good. Now the next question. Hey, where are you going? What is something important for someone who prints? Yeah, give me a second. Give me a second to write the question. Question four. Hey, hey, take it easy. The printer speed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but so what is that? 600 DPI? Um, no, that is not the speed. Mm, um, mm, the, the, no. What is something important for someone who prints a lot? What is, what do they say here? Uh, well, no, but there is something here. Is that the speed of printer? Yeah, if you do, yeah, this is the answer actually. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, uh, they say, look at what they say here. If you do much printing, the speed of the printer become, becomes important. Uh -huh. Yes, it's the speed. According to the article. Yeah, I know that maybe you prefer uh, the quality of printing. Maybe you prefer uh, other things, resolution, I mean. Uh, but according to the article, that is the information. The speed of the printer becomes important. And the last one. Oh, that 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 is good too. A black and white printer. Where is that? In color. Yes, this is this is good. This is part of that answer. See, sí, también. Podemos incluir en la respuesta esto. Users who don't have a specific need for color who print a lot of pages will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Yeah, that that is another thing that could be important. But if you don't print, you don't need color. But if you need color, you, you prefer speed. And the last question, let me write it. What is the amount of memory that most printers come with? According to the article, one megabyte. according to the article. Yes, but how much? It's a small, but how much? Uh -huh. Well, actually the article says megabyte, not gigabyte. It's different, right? Megabyte and gigabyte, or no? I am not an expert. I'm not an expert, but. One gigabyte is more to megabyte. Yeah, one gigabyte is more than a megabyte, definitely. Okay, uh, I don't know if our, uh, current uh, printers come with one megabyte or more nowadays, because this article is old. Now. Mm -hmm. There are 1,024 megabytes in one gigabyte. Ah, okay. Thank you for the information. And printers now come only with one megabyte or more? More to show. More. More because you can expand the memory if ah. you want. Ah, okay. How can you expand the memory of a printer? Do you know? I think there is the pants, the, the printer. <laughs> yeah, but how? So you need to insert something like an... Or you have to open it and... 
¿Cómo se expande la memoria de un impresor? I don't know. Some, some printer are, are um, como, son como una computadora, are computers, casi que una computadora. Ah. Uh, Así okay. se puede expandir. Ah, okay. okay. Not like a cell phone. You only insert. Yeah, the, the cell phone can expand the memory too. Yes. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Well, I would like you to do something with that article. Okay. Which is that you have that you uh, should do when you read something. Es decir, cuando leamos algo, algo, algún libro, algún artículo, alguna revista, algo en internet, hagamos siempre esto. Busquen ahorita, te voy a pedir only five. Five new words. In that article. Busquen five new words for you. For real. For real, okay? Five. And look for the meaning in the dictionary. Busquen en el dictionary, en el words, word. ¿Cómo se llama? Word reference. Dot com. Bueno, ese es el que yo les he dado. Nine. Ok. Five new words for you. New vocabulary. From the article. Look for the meaning. And write them in the chat. Five new words. Vamos a enriquecernos todos ahí con nuevo vocabulario. Ay, don Salvador. Hola, don Gilberto. Hola, don Salvador. ¿Qué dice? No mandaron, no nos mandaron a reunión como otras veces, sino que directo cayó, ¿verdad? No, si aquí estamos todos siempre. Ah. Sí, sí. Solo que todos han quitado la foto. Han quitado el video. Pero uno lo ve. Eh, ya, bueno, es, tra pero... es trabajo individual. <risa> Buscar cinco palabras en el, en el artículo. Nuevas. Y buscar su significado. De acuerdo.
When you finish your five words, please write them in the chat uh, with the meaning. Cinco palabras, pongalas en el chat con el significado, please. Write the five words in the chat with the meaning. Son palabras que encuentren en el artículo, palabras nuevas. Ok, shameful. Oh. Palabras del artículo, les pedí que en el artículo busque cinco palabras nuevas. Que sea nueva para, para mí, por ejemplo. Sí. Pero del okay. artículo. I'm sorry. Teacher, where is yep. the exactly the where is the exactly meaning of sharpness? Yeah. Okay. 
in this case, because they are talking about the quality or the resolution of the picture, sharpness sería lo que ha puesto ahí algo, nitidez, la nitidez de la, aunque también significa filo, como tú has, como tú has puesto, ¿verdad? Los cuchillos, ¿verdad? El, el, es el filo, sharp. No, es una cualidad también. Incluso exactitud. Por ejemplo, cuando tú dices, I will be there at three o'clock sharp. La misma palabra, sharp. Voy a estar allá a las tres en punto exacto. ¿Verdad? Sharp. Tiene varios significados. Okay, ahí el, ahí el, el contexto es el que nos ayuda a ver cuál es el que aplica. Ok. Teacher, tiene apagado el micrófono. Ok, gracias. Uh, so in the chat, ustedes pueden ver, hay muchas palabras, ¿verdad? Las suyas, las de otros. Que pueden uh, tomar. Ok. Eso es bueno hacerlo con cualquier cosa que llegue a sus manos, algo que lean. ¿verdad? resaltar nuevas, nuevas palabras, nuevo vocabulario así se va enriqueciendo el vocabulario ok ok, incluso si pueden eh, donde trabajan o si ustedes frecuentan pegar papelitos con palabras y sus significados para tenerlas ahí memorizando new vocabulary that is the es una buena manera de ir aprendiendo un nuevo vocabulario ok very good let's continue now with lesson four or no actually lesson three from this unit which is about Complain. Complain. Let's see. Okay. You have a question here. Well, the, the objective of, of this lesson is
it will be able to fill out a complaint form. Fill out a complaint form, okay? What is the meaning of complaint? Alguien sabe que significa complaint? Queja, sufrimiento. <laughs> no, 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 todas las palabras son similares en español. <laughs> Y hay algunas que son parecidas y no significan lo mismo que en español. <risa> Complain significa queja. Reclamo. Complain. Queja. Complain. Yes. Queja no de dolor, ¿verdad? No, queja de un, de un reclamo. Se quiere poner un reclamo. Entonces, uh, fill out es eh, llenar, llenar, completar. A complaint form. Form, what is form? Formulario. Un formulario, correcto. La no es forma. Un formulario. You will be able to fill out a complaint form. Fill out es es llenar un, algo que hay que, eh, eh, como un formulario, ¿verdad? Fill out. <clears throat> Now, we have two questions here. Do you ever complain about the broken items at your workplace? Do you ever complain about the broken items, artículos arruinados o equipo arruinado at your workplace? Yes. Do you do that? Yeah. This printer is not working. Or this cash register is not working. Okay. Do you fill, up, fill complaint forms at work? No. <laughs> no, that is not the, the procedure. Es no es el procedimiento. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's take a look to this conversation about between Mike and Maria. Mike and Maria. Okay. Okay, let me see. I'm going to record the conversation here. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. Computer. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Okay, one more time. Listen to the pronunciation and intonation, please. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You are welcome. Okay. Now repeat, please. Thank you for calling the IT department. Thank you for calling the IT department. 
Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. It was very slow yesterday. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Let me send someone with a complaint. Or can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You are welcome. You are welcome. Okay. Very good. Now. I am Mike and you are Maria, okay? Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, Hello my, my name, name is, is Maria, Maria Ochoa. Ochoa. Maria Ochoa. Maria Ochoa. I, I need, need to file a complaint about, about my work in about my work oh, oh, computer. computer. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was it very was slow yesterday. yesterday. It didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. Let me send someone with a complaint form. No, Thank you're you. Maria. <laughs> you are welcome. Sorry. Okay, no problem. Now you are Mike and I am Maria. This Mario is wrong. This must be Mike. Okay, you are Mike. You begin. One, two, three. Thank, Thank you for calling the IT department. IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. I'm, I'm sorry, sorry to hear that. that. This is the problem. problem. Why is problem? It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me, Let me send, send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay, very good. So observe what she said. She says I need to file a complaint. File a complaint. Yeah, file is like present a complaint. Okay. They use the same verb when they talk about taxes. Cuando hablan de impuestos. You file your taxes to present us to tus impuestos, tu declaración de impuestos. Okay, ese es el significado de file aquí. No es file de archivo o de archivar. Okay, esto es presentar. I need to file a complaint. Necesito presentar un, un reclamo, una queja, ¿no? About my work terminal. Okay. And she's going to send a complaint form. Un formulario de reclamo. Um, just one expression when he says, I uh, will send a, uh, we can send a computer in no time. What do you think is the idea of in no time? Poco tiempo. Uh-huh. 
It's another way to say right now, immediately, yeah, so soon. Es otra forma de decirlo, ¿no? Pronto, rápido, inmediatamente, ¿no? en poco tiempo, so soon, in no time. You're welcome. Es la respuesta común a thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. I'm going to say this. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry to hear that. It is one way to show empathy. Empathy. Es una manera de mostrar empathy. Empatía, ¿no? I'm sorry to hear that. Cuando alguien te cuenta algún problema, algo que está pasando, oh, I, I'm sick, estoy enfermo, you could say, oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Okay, I had an accident. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. No, Lamento escuchar. Okay. Very good. And remember, this is IT, okay? Not it. Ni IT. IT es otro. IT. So I will give you time to practice the conversation and to respond to these two questions. What expression does Mike use to show a solution in progress? And what seems to be the problem with the computer? Two questions to respond. Okay. I will send you to working pairs to practice the conversation. If it soon works faster. Okay. Right. Then. Let's see these two guys together. Okay. Join your groups, please. Practice the conversation and respond to questions.
Okay, we have a few minutes. Well, not too much. But maybe we can hear a couple of groups. Okay. Let's hear Carla and Julio, please. Present okay. the conversation. Thank you, thank you. Okay, Carla, comience. Okay. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, I'm my name is. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> my name is Maria Ochoa, and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday, and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complete form the cancer and new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, very good. Now Omar and Rosaline. Okay. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa, and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal computer. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday, and it didn't, it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Very good. Alison and Daniel. Alison and Daniel. Okay. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa, and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal computer. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me send some with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, very good. Um Salvador, who is your partner? No, tuve. Oh, algo pasó ahí. Okay, any volunteer to practice with Salvador? Rosaline is there. Okay, thank you, Rosaline. <laughs> okay. And if si quiere que le empiece o como, como usted. Hey, okay. Salvador, your mic. Okay. Thank you for calling to IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa, and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal computer. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday, and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, very good, thank you. And finally, Elwin and Jose Andres, please. 
Okay. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa, and I need to file a complaint about my word terminal. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday, and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You are welcome. Okay, very good. What expression does Mike use to show a solution in progress? Okay, so we can send a new computer. He sent new computer. We can send a new computer in no time. Yeah. Seems to be the problem with computer. It's very slow and I didn't uh, turn on. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Wow. Well, the next step is to work on this, but we're going to do this on Monday. Okay, people, we only have two days to finish this module. Please remember um, to complete the homework and the final exam. Tuesday is the last day. Tuesday, they will start completo todo. Very good. Alison Andrea Serrano. Present teacher. Thank you. Have a good night. Good night. Carla Jasmine Rivera. Carla se nos fue. Carlos Jonathan Garcia. No apareció. Eh, Daniel Ernesto Membreño. Present. Okay, Daniel. See you on Monday. Nah. Edwin Mauricio Pineda. Present teacher. Good night, everyone. See you. See you. Eric Mauricio Cruz. Present. Okay. Gilberto Benito Santa Maria. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Jennifer Guadalupe Lía. Present teacher. Good night. Good night, Jennifer. Uh, Jose Andres Martinez. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Julio Cesar Fabian. Present teacher, see you on Monday. See you on Monday. No hay Gustavo Núñez. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Omar Alexander Chávez. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Raúl Edgardo Sarceño. John. Eh, Rosalina Esmeralda Sánchez. Present teacher. Okay. Salvador Alberto Soriano. Present. Okay. Virginia del Carmen Vázquez. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Vladimir Alejandro García. William Boris Roque. Present teacher. Okay. 
en William Rodrigo Ana. Okay, people, that's all for today. Have a good night. Enjoy your weekend. See you on Monday. Bye bye. Bye, teacher. Hola. Teacher, a mí me sacó, a mí me sacó de la de la reunión y cuando usted pasó lista, no me no me había conectado de nuevo. Ah, okay. Soy Carla. Okay, Carla. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Good night.